Hello everybody, my name is John Mark Johnson Jr. I'm the host of Reform GGA and today I'm doing an Im initial impressions video of a product that I got for a gun that has not arrived yet so I just have the product and I've been sitting there fiddling with it and I wanted to give you guys a kind of a little bit of a, a teaser of this thing. Uh, just looking at the cover of the box here it is called the Hard Charger by Devil Dog Concepts and what it is is something that converts an AR style gun into something that has a side charging feature. Now personally I really like side charge and guns. I happen to own a couple of AKs and a lot of the other guns that I own are side charging guns and so it's just kind of what I'm used to and so I like it when things are side chargers. Um, that's one of the things that annoys me about ARs. ARs are certainly not bad guns. They're very functional, um, very adaptable. There's many good reasons to like ARs. The very awkward rear charging handle is not one of them. And so if you're someone like me that gets annoyed by that kind of thing, a hard charger by Devil Dog Concepts may not be a bad option. Now the particular gun that I'm gonna put it on is not a conventional AR, it's basically been an AR that's been reworked a little bit to fire 762 by 39 Those of you guys who have been following my stuff know that's kind of my caliber uh, for 2020 and now going into 2021. Um, so the gun that it's going to be in is going to be a little bit different. I'm probably going to have to modify some things on this particular product, uh, product to make it work for that gun. But it is nonetheless an interesting concept. Go ahead and show you the inside of the box here. It comes with a little bit of instructional material and you know basic disclaimers, limited warranty, all that kind of stuff. A Devil Dog Concept sticker. And then it has a little uh, Allen wrench. And then it has the hard charge itself. And I'll go ahead and take that out show you guys that in a little bit more detail. It is a remarkably simple concept that costs, you know, between 100 and 150 bucks depending on what kind of a sale you're able to get. I was able to get this one on sale for around 120, uh, but still fairly expensive. But the idea is that you have your normal charging handle. You can see that normal charging handle more or less, and then it connects to something that you actually a screw on to the outside of uh, the gun. So this little bracket up here is a, a Picatinny uh, mount and it will sit on the outside of the gun and this sits at the very uh, furthest rail on your AR. Now Devil Dog Concepts makes ones that have this little attachment point at different places along uh, the hard charger so that you can have it set up like you want. They have one that's all the way forward, they have one that's basically all the way back, and then they also have one that's, uh, I think it's like two or three spaces forward, so that if you want to put a backup flip up side on there or something like that, you can. Um, so they offer different uh, attachment points. I like the idea of the forward one just because it allows me to put most of my optics and whatnot on the back, which is my normal habit, or fairly far forward on the receiver, but not all the way uh, forward. That's probably gonna work out best for me. Um, so you have a charging handle, but the charging handle is just a little bit different. You can see the main part of the, the T-shape there. It just has this little extension over on the side that uh, fits into the, the part that you bolt onto the AR. And inside of that, there is the actual charging handle itself. So screw this on to basically the top of the receiver, slide in the charging handle, and that feels like that is a steel rod, which is a good thing. And then the uh, charging handle would basically go into the upper receiver in the normal way, making sure that you get uh, the extra little rod inside of the, uh, the hole for the charging handle. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Very simple little idea uh, that allows you to use the handle on the side to move the charging handle. It doesn't really mess with the effectiveness of the charging handle itself. It still basically functions as a charging handle. If you want to, it just means that you have the option of now running it from the side. Uh, people have pointed out 
justly so, that having this little uh, device on the side can become an extra snag point. So if you have a lot of gear on or something like that, yeah, that can snag. Um, and I would just say that depends on your particular purpose of use, whether that's going to be an issue for you. If you are a competitive shooter, um, first of all, putting extra bit of weight on the gun that isn't really super necessary is probably not a, a great idea for a competitive uh, shooter. Um, and then, of course, competitive shooters will often have some kind of a rig on, either a belt or a chest rig or some combination thereof, where they have extra magazines and whatnot. And yeah, having that extra uh, handle snag point could be a bit of an issue for someone like that or someone, um, you know, obviously for people that are doing some kind of military uh, training or even self-defense training that involves some kind of kit uh, that they'd be wearing. Yeah, that can be an issue. But there's a lot of people, including myself, that have a lot of guns that we don't really shoot for those purposes they're mostly just recreational kind of bench guns or if we do shoot them it's usually uh, uh, from a standing position not at the bench it's usually without a whole lot of kits on it's mostly just for plinking purposes and for something like that if you're someone who prefers a side charging instead of having to go back and get the the rear charging handle this could be a very viable option especially depending on what you plan on putting on the gun if you plan on putting say a hyper power variable optic on your ar uh, that uses up a lot of rail space really quickly and sometimes it's really hard to get in there and get to the charging handle when you have something like that on there and this because it charges on the side could be a useful option for that um, the particular gun that I'm going to be putting it on doesn't have a conventional AR magwell. Instead, it actually has a magwell that's designed to take AK magazines, so a rock and lock system. And because of that, it doesn't have a bolt hold open like most ARs do. That's one of the disadvantages of rock and lock magazines is it's hard to get a true bolt hold open mechanism with those. They do have some that have followers that will stick up when you're and done with the magazine that will hold the bolt open but as soon as you drop the magazine the bolt comes forward it's not a true bolt hold open and if you don't have a gun with a bolt hold open you're going to have to charge the gun every single time you put in a new magazine well charging it from the rear on some guns especially if they have fairly stiff recoil springs and whatnot can be a little bit troublesome side charger kind of helps alleviate some of those problems it's not a perfect solution to every problem uh, but for some people in some situations, especially relatively static, don't have a lot of kit on, um, maybe trying to get around using an awkward optic or trying to deal with a situation with not having a last round bolt hold open and want something that's a little quicker to activate, et cetera, et cetera, it can be a useful thing. Uh, this is looks like a fairly strong product. Uh, the major components are 7075 aluminum and steel which is basically the same thing that your AR is made out of, so I wouldn't have any great qualms about that. Um, right now, this thing is pretty dry. The, the main uh, sliding area has a little bit of grease on it, uh, but of course the charging handle itself and everything else is pretty dry, so I'm probably gonna have to put some lube on it before I actually use it. And like I said, this one probably won't fit the gun I want perfectly. I'm probably gonna have to do a little bit of file work. But overall, I think this will be a, a fun little addition and make it a little, uh, make my IR that I don't have yet a little bit more like my other guns, a little bit more like my AKs, a little bit more like my CZ Scorpions and other side charging guns that are out there. It just makes it more uniform for me. So that is the Devil Dog Concepts Hard Charger, which is basically a side charging adaptation for a standard aluminum receiver AR-15. Thank you very much for your time and attention. For those of you who are in Christ, go with God and be blessed. For those of you who are not, I pray that you come to know the true Christ of history. Amen.